Hey guys, what's going on? James here, and in this video today, we're going to be talking about how the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have released punter Sterling Hoffrichter from his contract. This is the second punter the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have released this offseason. The first one being Bradley Pinion that we talked about in a separate video. Now they have released Sterling Hoffrichter, which is a little bit of a shame. Love the guy's name. I thought he did some good stuff for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers last season whenever he was filling in for the injured Bradley Pinion. But as we said in that Bradley Pinion video, the writing was on the wall, folks. Whenever Jake Camarda was drafted by this team in the fourth round of this recent NFL draft, it was pretty much essentially set in stone that Bradley Pinion and Sterling Hoffrichter were going to be going to different teams in the future. Now, Bradley Pinion already signed with the Atlanta Falcons. The Buccaneers will see him twice a year. I really do hope that Sterling Hoffrichter will find some other team that will pick him up and give him a chance, or hey, maybe there's even a possibility that the Tampa Bay Buccaneers can bring him back on their practice squad as well. You never know whenever you need those emergency special teams type players, especially in the past couple of seasons. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers have liked having an extra kicker or an extra punter in case of emergencies due to injury, illness, whatever situation it may be. With the expansion of the practice squad, there is definitely room for an emergency special teams guy if you need him. Hopefully, you know, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers can have a guy like Sterling Hoffrichter be available if they need him. But also, you know, I kind of want to see this guy also get another starting opportunity elsewhere with another team as well. But Folks, uh, this essentially means that Jake Camarda is going to be the starting punter for the Bucks. That's expected. He has done some overall fine things. It's really tough to, you know, gauge how a punter is doing in a training camp, but I haven't heard anything negative, so it seems like that's a good thing in of itself. He is going to be the starting punter for the Bucks moving forward. What do you guys think about the release of Sterling Hoffrichter? Let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions down in the comments section below. I would love to hear them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video or the next live stream. But until then, and as always, guys, goodbye for now, and go Bucks.